Hi right, guys, Finn here. Before I do a quick video on Lead Your Fan Control, a program that allows you to set a custom fan curve for your laptop, I highly recommend you download it. It's very helpful for keeping your laptop cool. So once you come to the Lead Your Fan Control website, which I'll have linked in the description, you want to scroll down to Downloads, click on the current version and download that. Uh, the first time you download this, you might get an error. A virus, okay, you just won't download it. will say you know, it has a virus. However, it's a false positive. You just want to come down to your Windows Defender and just allow it to fret. However, if you don't want to use it as well, that's fine. But once you do download it, you want to come to your Downloads just extract that and just let it install so once it installs i'll come back to you guys it's installed now so you want to just click, double click on it and you'll likely get an error as you can see yep leave your fan control cannot run with vulnerable driver block lists it tells you what to do here but what you want to do is just basically just come down here go to registry editor so just make sure you just type registry editor into there and i'll have this uh directory linked in the description copy and paste click on this vulnerable driver block list and change it from a one to a zero click ok and now you want to reboot your system so i'll come back to you guys once i've rebooted so my laptop's rebooted now so i'm just going to double click this and it should just work yep so some people say they get a different error after this i personally don't have i will link the uh, lenovo subreddit and the discord in the description so you can ask people that can actually help you so once you open the program it should default to performance mode if you use performance mode if you don't you know if you use balanced and quiet you know you have to set your own curves i don't use these two modes ever but in performance mode this is the curve that i use i'm pretty sure these three are default but these two i changed this one to 68 the fourth option and the fifth option i changed to 72. now you can like mess around with these sliders i leave it on default but once you do change your settings here click the save icon here now you can also use turbo mode it does boost the uh the fans to i think 5400 rpm however i wouldn't mess around with that it can you know break your system <laughs> but like it's your choice but i wouldn't use that if you come down to these cog wheels though you can have it launch or start up and start minimize if you just want to basically use it 24 7. i don't i only launch it when i'm about to play a game so that's the options that i use you know i hope this video is helpful to you guys you know thanks for watching and i'll also have a quick video right at the end where i test the fan control on versus off in 3d mark